So Esther, do you want to talk about why you've come to training today? Uh, because I've been looking for a business for about two years and um, I've had my heart set on gyms for, yeah, um, because they offer great training and support and also because I have a three-year-old um, and being laundry, um, he would be able to come with me and I would still be able to look after him. Yeah, because we, yeah. we saw you at the Franchising Expo and you come up and introduce yourself and you yeah. told us you were looking at it for a while, which is very common for people because it can be very hard to know, you know, is it actually going to be what it's be and you do your research and stuff. So... In your research and investigation, what was appealing to you? Um, well, the online content has been great. And it wasn't until I met Jim in person at the Franchise Expo. He, he just said to me, you should look into laundry. And I did. And um, so I called Bill straight away. And, and here I am. Yeah, I think it's because of the yeah. situation you described. You've got a young, young kid yeah. at home. And what could be something that you could do which could manage around the lifestyle? So. Yeah. Was that was the most appealing thing to you was that lifestyle or yes the lifestyle yeah and yeah. because there's no childcare available where i am yeah 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 you're in um warnable but you're a couple of a little bit out of warnable so in a rural area but do you talk about the training itself how's the training experience been for you oh it's been great um it's been very informative and the stories that the franchises share have been yeah really um motivating um, and informative and the examples they give have been fantastic and yeah just helpful I've taken a lot of notes and yeah I feel very encouraged by what they've taught us yeah that's great to hear and you have watched a lot of online content so has it married up with what we put out online to what you've been seeing in training yeah very similar content and but it's good to see it in person and to be able to talk talk it through with other franchisees over lunch and meals and yeah yeah, and you've taken a long time to make the jump. Two years you've been looking at it for. So what was the final step for you to then make the decision to do it? Because it can be quite a big decision. Yes, uh, because I've, I've looked into a few different divisions. So I started off with bookkeeping. So, so my criteria was, was that it had to be something that I could do, hopefully from home, and also it would fit in with my young family life. And um, so I looked into a few different divisions and I've been turned away from one of them and and then when um, Jim suggested I look into laundry and I called Bill and it just worked out from there so that's why I'm here. That's great to hear. Now was there any part of the training that stood out for you so far? Was it meeting Jim or hearing Jim's session or what, what so far of the training will you take away when you go back to ne um, near Bonneville where you live? Um, so the marketing side because I'm in a rural area so you know, when I came, I was really nervous and really worried that I won't be able to get any clients. But the other franchisees, they are so confident and they are so encouraging. They just say, don't worry about it. You know, you will cross the, you'll cross the bridge when you, I don't yeah, know. It's, yeah, well, it's always a worry for everyone, but that, yeah. also we've got the pay for work guarantee in place. So that way you can get your name out there. You can do the, the free services. And the great thing of laundry, because it's a repeat business, yeah. you can do the free service and they're like, you do such a fantastic job, get you back in place, which is there to help you as well to get you going. Yes, but I've spoken to other franchisees in laundry and they've said that they cannot find people to do the free services. So I had worries there, you know, because, yeah, you can work for free, but if you can't find anyone to work for, you don't get paid. So, so yeah, but I feel so confident now and I, I feel like I can market myself locally and I'll be fine. Yeah. That's fantastic. Is there any advice for someone who might be thinking about it in a similar situation for you about doing this? Is it something where you, what advice would you tell them? Oh, I think, um, yeah, looking to laundry if you have a young family um, and you want something that um, you can do from home or at a laundromat, I think the flexibility um, really sold it to me. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, thank you very much, Esther. And we're looking forward to following your journey. Thank you. <laughs>